Hello, I'm Milo for the Alice Trading Company. And today we're talking about touring the Seine. This famous river starts in northeastern France, flows through the ancient city of Troyes, and on to Paris and the English Channel via Le Havre. The river helped establish the town early on as a trading center centuries ago, but now undoubtedly adds to the romance of the city of love. There are numerous places where you can descend to the river's banks and walk along stone paths on either side. Benches, playgrounds, and even little landscaped nooks and crannies abound. Some of the best views are around the Ile de la Cité and the neighboring Ile Saint-Louis. Since the city sprung up on the river at the Ile de la Cité and continued to expand outward from it, some of the best places to see are along the Seine's banks. In almost any climate and possibly any time of the day or night, the river is a romantic space, a very real artery to the heart of the city. Definitely take time to wander its banks and dip out of the hustle and roar of the city's traffic. Whether alone or with a companion, you'll find it well worth it. The river is a character in history and fiction and has understandably inspired many works of art. For instance, Javert in Le Miserable commits suicide by diving into the river after a heart-wrenching death aria. The banks of the Seine are a UNESCO World Heritage Site, which includes the many bridges that are well worth checking out. You should note that the designation right bank and left bank are for when you are facing downstream or basically northwest. So the Latin quarter would be the left bank. There are many ways of seeing the river and its bankside sites. Other than a tourist bus or walking, you can take one of the many river cruises of various lengths and purposes. Be sure to check out all the options before committing to one to make sure you know what you're getting into. Check out our guide on Paris for more detailed information. For more of our work, check out alicetc.com.